In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was God, and the Word was with God. He was in the beginning with God. All things were made through Him, and without Him nothing was made that was made. In Him was life. In Him was life, and the life was the light of men, and the light shines in the darkness, and the darkness did not comprehend it. Lord, we want tonight our light to shine in the darkness. We want our light to shine tonight, Lord. We want our light to shine. Send forth your rays of light through us, Lord, into this world that does not comprehend you, Lord. The darkness cannot comprehend you, so we ask for the light. We ask for light, Jesus tonight to go forth from this place, Lord, in the Spirit, Lord, in the Spirit, Lord. We need light. We need your light, Lord. For we will stumble in the darkness if we cannot see our way, Lord. We need the light. We need the light of Christ. We need you, Yeshua. Yeshua, set up your lampstand in our midst. Set up your lampstand. Set up your lampstand in our midst, Yeshua. Protect the wicks, Lord. Let the wind not blow it out, Lord. Let the flame burn, Lord. Higher and higher, Lord. We want to see, we want to see, we want to be ready for your return, Lord. We want to see, Lord.
I just call them forth in the name, the beautiful name, Lord, that they would know you, Lord, tonight. Lord, have mercy. Lord, I lift up Benjamin Natanahu, oh, Lord. The weight of the world is on his shoulders, Lord, but I ask, oh, God, I ask for your mercy. Lord, I stand in the gap for my brother, Lord, he doesn't know. Have mercy on him, oh, God. that you would supernaturally enlighten him and give him strategies from your throne room. That which has been obscured, let it be opened. Oh God, have mercy. Lord, I lift up the West Bank and I lift up the Gaza and I ask, oh God, mercy. Mercy on the sons of Ishmael, Lord. I ask mercy on the sons of Ishmael, oh God. Lord, send your angels, Lord. Give them dreams. Disrupt the plans of the enemy. Let the, let the chariot wheels fall off. Let the rockets explode in their bunkers. The oh Lord, that they not one would hit their target, oh God. Have mercy. Disrupt the plans of the enemy, oh God. Lord, I bless Israel. And I speak kindly to Jerusalem. And I ask, Father, for each and every Israeli soldier, Lord, multiply them, multiply them like David's mighty fighting men, oh God. Let the world stand amazed, Lord, at the power, because your word is true. You are the God of Israel. You are the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And it's because of them that we live. The blood speaks through that line. Then the Lord will be zealous for his land and pity his people. The Lord will answer and say to his people, Behold, behold, I will send you grain and new wine and oil, and you will be satisfied by them. I will no longer make you a reproach among the nations, but I will remove far from you the northern army and will drive him away into a barren and desolate land with his face toward the eastern sea and his back toward the western sea. Fear not, O land, be glad and rejoice, for the Lord has done marvelous things. Do not be afraid, you beasts.